New at 11, invasive iguanas leave their mark in a family's hot tub. Uh, yuck. Yeah. It's now a costly cleanup and a health hazard. WPTV News Channel 5's Andrew Lawholm has the story from West Palm Beach. It was perhaps a hot summer night. The temperature was just right. They're cold blooded. They like to warm up. They come out in the sun to warm up. You know, maybe they're going for a late night dip and uh, recharging. I don't know. As if they were unruly Airbnb guests, the reptiles left behind a salmonella surprise. That's filled with iguana feces. The hot tub is a toilet. The pool is still a pool. This is going to cost them a good amount of money. Mike Kimmel, a.k.a. the Python Cowboy on Instagram, is an animal trapper. All right, buddy. Go on. An innocuous possum is free to go, but the invasive iguana is hunted. The Florida Wildlife Commission recently reminded homeowners that they can kill iguanas if they see them lurking on their property. Kimmel wants FWC to give more direction on how and what to do with the bodies. We're definitely having a lot of wounded iguanas, um, inhumane kills, and a lot of probably illegal body disposals and, and all of that. I kind of take personally. He will turn his kills into wallets and meat. You can see we're actually uh, one of my bullet holes there. Despite efforts to curb the raging population, Mother Nature didn't hold up their end of the bargain. Since we haven't had a cold snap uh, this last winter, um, the population's definitely exploded out of control. In West Palm Beach, Andrew Lafom, WPTV News Channel 5.